Welcome to the review for the Cardinal Bees. I'm here for the 2024 all new Hyundai Santa Fe. It comes with two different engines, 2.5 liter turbo and 1.6 liter turbo hybrid. The diminution and design, packaging, everything has been changed. Let's take a look. Well, finally I got a chance to look around the interior. Over the design of dashboard is similar with Hyundai Ajera or Hyundai Sonata, but this steering wheel is shaped like Hyundai's Ajara's one. Also, the overall interior theme of design is really boxy, kind of retro design. And here's a cargo space, and also here is cargo space. This is the coolest thing of this car. This car has a two of the wireless charger, and this controlling panel is touch over here this is physical button and let's check the ui i think there's nothing special from new hyundai car like hyundai new sonata or new kona this car has the same ui design look at this door panel it also has a some kind of classical boxy design electric parking brake located over here and this is the coolest feature of this car with this center cargo space you can open like this and you can open like this it is like magical glow box personally I like the design of this car's seat and also the digital cluster same here and it comes with both speaker system massage feature and column style gear shift lever and let's find the new Feature. And this is one of the coolest feature of this car. You can open and close like this. This is the handle so you can climb the car and use this. You can get easy access to the roof. And this car has a really boxy interior and also boxy design. It comes with third row seat too. And with this large square design window. And there is a Type-C charger. Also AC band, cup holder, family car definitely need this. And let's check out the engine of this car. This new Santa Fe comes with two different engine types, 2.5 liter turbo and 1.6 liter turbo hybrid. Engine is located really low location so I think the weight balance of this car it will be not that bad. But the design it looks like boxy SUV like Land Rover Defender or something like that kind of car. Car is based on the front drive and this is the characteristic of this car. This car comes with a huge tailgate. The entrance of trunk is really wide. This car is just ready for car camping full flat for this seat. Let's go check another car. So this is matte white finished car. Look at this. Hmm. And let's check the second low passenger seat. This car is six seater version and, and the seat adjustment of six seater. It is electric. It also has a, another roof. And here's holder for the back. Ace vent. There is a cargo space over here and you can open up over here and the driver also can open like this and the overall dash design is just like newer Hyundai car like Hyundai Ajera or Sonata I think if you have a chance to use the third row often the six seater will be better because you can have a easy access to the third row and I like the arm Holder like this, and this car has a very many of cup holder. Let's count: one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, and twelve. So this new Santa Fe has a twelve cup holder and six Type C charger. So we don't need to fight. And this is the coolest thing: the height of this car is really tall. So the third row person has a large space. Over here, I will check the third row seat. In the case of the six seater model, you can fold the second row seat electrically and access them. It's naturally narrower than the second row, but not uncomfortably so. Of course, it doesn't offer as spacious of an area as SUV.
SUV like the Tahoe or minivans do compared to the Kia Sorento, a competing model, it is wider and more comfortable for the third row. There's even air conditioning on the side and armrest on the cup holder. So it is not bad, but once again, it is not as comfortable as a minivan. I will warp up the Santa Fe review with this today. The new Santa Fe review video isn't over. So subscribe to watch another video and wait for upcoming ones. If you have any questions, leave a comment and I will respond. Thanks for watching until here. Goodbye.